<laughs> hey people, this is Frost from Now. Welcome back for more. Let's play Luigi's Hidden Mansion in the last episode. We actually beat Area 3, and now we're on to Area 4. And we'll be going all the way back up to the roof. Balcony thing, a majigger, la. <laughs> I'm in a good mood today, guys, can't you tell? Okay, so what we're going to do is go all oh! <laughs> oh up. <laughs> so yeah, we'll be doing that. Anyways, I would like to call, talk about a couple things. Ooh, you know what? Let me see if there's any money in here. No, never mind. Um, a couple things I want to talk about. Uh, I didn't upload anything yesterday because I was at my dad's, and it's okay. I never really uploaded anything anyway. <laughs> what a joke. <laughs> see? Frostbite for Pernod is a kidder. Oh, man, am I in a good mood today. We got a gold bar out of here. So let's go ahead and grab that. Um... So we will be actually going up to the fourth floor, which is not lit up yet. Let's go ahead and get rid of these bats. Bats, get rid of the bats. See if we got some, any uh, money in here. Oh, come on. Come off it. I guess it doesn't want to give up. Okay, in here, it's already lit. So let's see if we can get any coins. Whoa, okay, we got a poison mushroom. And we got a heart. Let's go ahead and grab that. Yeah. Let's see if we got anything in this chest. Just another heart. Let's go ahead and... Save that for later, in case. We're back to the mundane music that we always loved. Oh yes. Uh, excuse me for a moment. No, Jov, I would not like to update at this moment. I am recording. Okay, I should have brought some water so I could water these plants. Oh, you know what? And speaking of which, we need to water that plant downstairs, and I'll make sure to do that in a bit. Okay, so basically what I would like to talk about is that I will be going over to Mr. Switzerland's house to hang out and probably spend the night. No Mario Sunshine is going to be uploaded today. As you know of yes... No, no, not yesterday. Yesterday, yesterday. The day before yesterday. I had recorded the last of the 100 coin missions and two 30 blue coin missions. How hard were those to do? I don't want to tell you. Anyways... No Mario Sunshine Day. I will make sure to take care of it tomorrow. We will be getting all the blue coin missions done, hopefully. And, uh... WarioWare is going to be uploaded today because I do not have a problem with that! So, alright, let's go ahead and move on. We are moving up to the point that we've always been waiting for. At the beginning of the game, and so on and so forth, I've been saying that if you've ever missed anything, you would have a second chance to be able to get them. This is where this is going to happen right now. We're actually going to get that second chance to go back and grab whatever we missed. And actually, this is the perfect moment because not a while ago, I had missed a piece of cheese in the room that was that we got the uh, ice element act at, actually. So now I'll be able to obtain that. We got a question mark, question mark, question mark. Criminy! A criminy! What a calamity! The, the, the electricity has gone out! That lightning strike must have must have caused a blackout. I can't see anything in this blast of darkness. The ghost will have to run to the place of the dark. Be careful, Luigi! Alright, so actually what I never got to do in my Let's Play is go through here. Now what you want to do is go through here after the lightning strikes. This is something really cool. Whoa, we just heard some telephone. I find this part extremely interesting and it can only happen at this time. This telephone is going to ring and we're going to pick it up. Hello? Hello? May I ask who's speaking, please? <laughs> okay. I want to explain what you just saw there in the corner. Now, people have speculated that there is an Easter egg in this game. When you're standing here, the shadow in the background looks like Luigi's being hung. This is only a speculation. I believe it is not true because, one, Luigi's arms aren't down to his sides. They're, only, they're in the exact same places. Two, his feet are upright. So what... M my thoughts, and there are no rope detection, like there's no rope shadow or anything. So what my thoughts are is just this bad dynamic. They never, they just, it was just a shadow that wasn't fixed. It was moved too far apart and spread from the wall. And I, I don't know, I don't really have any other, other way to explain it. That's just what's happening. Let's do this, Bowser. Eek! <laughs> I believe we answer the first phone now. Yes, we do. Hello? May I ask who is speaking, please? Le Luigi? Phew! It's me, Toad! I don't know what I've done if the ghost had answered! 
Anyway, we have a terrible problem. The lightning caused blackout of the host. What should we do? We're really, really afraid of the dark. Is there any way you can turn the lights back on? You don't want to turn them on. You're helping you know <laughs> me. But now that I think about it, I do remember seeing a large breaker switch somewhere in the basement. Now let's answer this other phone call. Because this will help us with getting our next mission done. H Hello? Howdy. Hello? Oh, sorry to surprise you, boy. It's for you, Professor Egad. Sorry for disturbing you. I know I usually can contact you by Game Boy Horror, but I thought you would try this phone since you were in the room. You know all the ghosts avoid the light and hide in the dark. But listen, there's one ghost who fled from the gallery who only hides in the darkest places. His name is Uncle Grimly. If he's on the loose, then now maybe your only chance is to get him. Why don't you try looking for him before you get those lights back on? Might be wise. He's old for a ghost, but that but it's only made him more cautious. I do know, though, that for some reason he tends to prefer rooms with mirrors. Uh oh, the ghosts are starting to approach your position. Be careful, Luigi! And attack! Now, I don't know if it locks up the main door, does it? Yes, it does! Oh my gosh, I did not... I did not prepare myself for this. I actually have only done this once, so I'm actually glad I did this. I just found this part really interesting. And Uncle Grimly is another very interesting ghost in this game that I never really learned too much about. Besides the fact that he's just that. But, uh, what other room in this house do we know of that has mirrors? Well, let's see. Is there any mirrors in this room that we can use to go ahead and get back to the foyer? I guess not. Okay, so here's what's going to be happening. Throughout the way down through the house, we're going to be attacked by a media onslaught of ghosts because of the darkness. It's very annoying and very, very... Obnoxious. 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 I'm noxious! I'm noxious! I'm noxious! Okay. <laughs> I'm noxious. Whoa! Going through the other room. I'm noxious! And we're heading downstairs. I would like to find a room that has a mirror so I can go ahead and get down to the foyer a lot faster. But again. Forgot, we're actually going to get a mouse in this episode because we ended up forgetting it last time. Oh, I'm noxious! I'm noxious! So annoying. Actually, this is a fast way down the foyer anyway. I'm noxious! What? No, give me my eyes! Give me eyes! Now, even if you kill all the ghosts in the room, which is your best bet. You'll actually not turn on the lights, which is actually really nice. So what we're going to do is go ahead and get rid of this dude. I don't know if there's any else. Okay, let's go ahead and get this cheese. No, come on. Target. There we go. Get that sucker. Get that sucker. Get him. There we go. And we got a ruby. <laughs> For the win. And you can go ahead and pick up all this money if you want to. And uh, that's pretty much it for this room, actually. So what we're going to do now is go all the way down to the foyer. And actually, there's only one uh, room in this game that particularly has uh, a very large mirror that we could use. Uh, besides Slim Bangshot's room, but that just seems a little too easy, don't you think? Now, what is another room in this game that actually has obnoxious? That actually has obnoxious people in it? Well... People who look at mirrors, that's what's obnoxious. Now, if you talk to the toad, you notice that the toad is actually gone, and we won't actually be able to get him at this point. I found this really interesting, and I think the chandelier is actually activated again, which is really, really interesting. Oh, great. Obnoxious! 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 Hey, guess what? Obnoxious! 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 I'm noxious. And here's the room. And we have Uncle Grimly, a very odd ghost to catch. You must wait for the perfect moment when he decides to show his heart, which is very weird. And when you turn around, I wasn't I was actually pretty lucky that time. But this guy will be the quickest to actually put his heart back when you turn around and it gets very annoying. Now the thing is is that he's a lot like Madame Clair Clairvoya. He doesn't fight back. And I'm not sure if I understand why this is a thing. Maybe it's because of his old age. 
And he says he's cautious, which is probably the fact of why he's a lot harder to show his heart. But I don't exactly understand why he gives up so easily. And you can use this mirror to actually take you back to the uh, foyer. I'm pretty sure we got everything else. I don't think we missed any speedy spirits so far. Did I see something? Oh, I guess I didn't. Um, but that I just found that really interesting. Um, so we're gonna go through this obnoxious hallway. Oh, that wasn't exactly obnoxious as usual. All right, so we're going down to the basement now. Like as I said, it is not possible to get the speedy spirits in this room. Nope. Expect. I mean, I know I've already gotten it, but you can't exactly get it ever again. Ooh. And I swear there's a golden mouse in this room. I swear. I guess not. Um. Is there a golden mouse in this room? I could swear that there was. Hmm. But uh, we can actually turn on this power switch. And let there be light. Da -da 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 -da. We got a boo in here. How about that? Let's see if we got anything in here. We should have a few coins, right? Yes, we should. That is fantastic. All right, let's go get our boo, which is one of the most annoying boos of the game if you don't catch them fast. Let's try to get this thing as fast as we can. Okay, go. 200 health. This thing, if it gets away. Okay. I'm not going to worry about it until later. Because that is one annoying boo to have to deal with. Oh wait, we have to go in there anyway. Well, you know what? Actually, before we go in there... Okay, we're going to go in there. <laughs> that was pointless. Um, Now, there should be a speedy spirit in here. I'm not sure where. It might be in a barrel. Or some sort. Oh, hi. I swear, I swear there's a speedy spirit in here. I'm just gonna kinda let them disappear and try to find this thing. Oh, we got a boo in here. Oh, that was close. Let's try to get past this room. Oh, we just got two of these guys? There's no speedy spirits in here? I could swear that there was. Uh, we're probably gonna get punched out. Whoops, that was my bad. That was totally all me. Yep, I caused my own death. Okay. Got that guy. We got this guy. Oh, we got a big heart. Let's get that. Burn, baby, burn. Even though that's irrelevant. Burn, baby, burn. Okay, let's go ahead and get this. Yes. Now I want to focus on go ahead and getting the uh, booze for this place and watering a couple of things before we end off this episode. Because now we have a key to a specific room that we will get to later. Now let's go ahead and shake this baby. And we got a gold bar. How about it? Come on, go over here. Okay, let's see if we got any boo activity up in here. Okay, we got one that's only 100 health. That ain't so bad. But he's probably gonna get away. Because the booze in the basement area in particular are very, very I don't know, they're a lot more mischievous. A little harder to get. So we're gonna try to uh, shake this thing up again and see what we get. Oh, okay, I guess that's it. Well, let's try to get that boo we missed. Oh whoops, that was my bad. That was me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was me. Get down. Yeah. My uh, hand smells like ham because of my dog. Oh, what's up, boo? Go on the other side and let him, let him. Oh, what? He went in there? What? They do that? Is that a thing now? Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? Actually, I would love to go in here for a quick second. See if he ran back in here. Okay, he didn't. Then they're going to be on the other side. That is totally okay. We will take care of it later. I'm not too worried about it. Let's go ahead and finish up watering a couple of things, and then we'll end off the episode. I know this has been a really boring, really stupid episode, but, uh, I don't give a shit. I don't care what you think. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Okay, let's go ahead and grab some water. 
Fantastic. Now we get something that is extremely valuable. If you want to get a hundred percent in this game, water this throughout all the three areas. And you get a golden diamond. Yes. This is worth so much money. And you get two of them in this area alone. One for that. And the second is for getting all the booze. Which we will have uh, around the end of the game. And that does not count the final boss himself, King Boo. Yeah, it's already kind of obvious that that's the final boss. We already got that done, and you know what, um, I think I'm gonna end off the episode. Uh, next time, we'll be going up to the roof, and going through some new rooms, and fighting some new ghosts, and Ghostbusters! Okay, I think I'm gonna save, and I'm gonna see you all later. So, I have been Frost by Fook now, now I'm somebody else. Like, comment, favorite, subscribe, all that YouTube stuff, and I will see you all later. Alright, goodbye.